to all the saints who believe. The love of God our Savior secures us for eternity. Beloved, the promise of eternal life our Lord made stands before us like a great beacon of hope. His word is not subject to failure and our faith is not in vain. We who believe he is the resurrection and the life. The one who conquered death and defeated the powers of this world live by his faith and his completed ministry and we await his call at that blessed moment we will have eternal life. I believe the Bible is the inspired and only infallible word of God that it has supreme authority in all matters of faith and conduct. I believe there is one God eternally existent in three persons, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I believe in the deity of our Lord Jesus Christ. In his virgin birth, his sinless life, his miracles, that his atoning death through his shed blood is the basis for reconciliation between a holy God and sinful man. I believe in his bodily resurrection from the dead, his ascension to the right hand of the Father, his current high priestly intercession through his blood for his own, and in his personal and visible return to earth in power and great glory. I believe in the present ministry of the Holy Spirit who has come to convince the world of sin and of righteousness and of judgment and by whose baptism we are born again whenever we first believe. I believe by whose indwelling the Holy Spirit enables us to repent and hate our sin and live a godly life. I believe that all are born in sin and that belief in Jesus Christ is absolutely essential for salvation. I believe in the resurrection of both the saved and the lost. They who are saved unto the resurrection of life and they that are lost unto the resurrection of damnation. Eternal separation from God forever in the lake of fire in their sins. I believe that Jesus Christ is the only head of his church and that all true believers are united as members of his body by the Holy Spirit. I believe that the greatest sign of our relationship as his family and our relationship to each other is the fruit of the love of Christ in us by the Holy Spirit. I believe in the gospel of the grace of God. I believe in the gospel of the kingdom that will be preached during the tribulation by saved Israelites and Gentiles that they convert and the kingdom that God will set up through Christ on earth according to his promise to King David. It will be centered in Jerusalem, Israel. This kingdom will be ruled by him and last a thousand years. I believe 
that we will assist the Lord during this time and we will dwell in the new Jerusalem that Jesus has built for us above the earth, the golden city of God. I believe the everlasting gospel will be proclaimed during the tribulation of judgment upon the wicked. It will be proclaimed by angels. It is good news to suffering believers during this period as it heralds their coming deliverance and reward. Beloved, one can rest easy who is in Christ before the seven-year tribulation begins. We will not be on earth for that one. It is a terrible time of judgment and God's wrath I believe the church is not appointed to wrath nor judgment. It will be called up by Christ as promised in John chapter 14 verses 1 to 3. It's known as the rapture. Beloved, thank you for taking time to visit me. You make me happy. When I was growing up, and friends or family came to my house, my mother would always feed and make them comfortable. I want to do likewise with all the brethren. May the Lord richly bless you and fill you with the Holy Spirit daily that you received when you first believed. This is the food that makes us strong. This is what we need, beloved. May God bless this message in your hearts and the hearts of the lost. And I pray this in Jesus' name.